make sure it's in focus. Okay. Is it all set? Yeah. Cool. So I am in the petrified forest in Northern California at the moment. And all of these rocks here actually used to be trees, which is really, really cool. And there's a guy in there that is going to tell us all about it. Yeah, well, essentially 3.4 million years ago, there was a huge volcanic eruption in this area. Um, located where current day Mount St. Helena is at the top of the Napa Valley there. Uh, it's important to know that Mount St. Helena is not a volcano. It's simply just a mountain that was uplifted after the volcano collapsed. So it's, it's made out of all the excess volcanic rock. It's in the same vague location, but not considered a volcano itself. Huh. But when the, the volcano erupted, it sent this huge cloud of volcanic ash roaring down the mountainside. Uh, traveling at speeds of up to 450 miles per hour and up to a thousand degrees hot. So, you know, when it's passing through a forest like the one we have out there today, most of the trees are going to be incinerated, but we did have a lot of redwoods back there. They were the primary tree. So most of those were just knocked down and then buried very rapidly under that volcanic ash. There. Wow. And um, they're buried so quickly that they're contained within an environment without oxygen. And because there's no oxygen there, it means that the tree is not going to decay at its normal rate. It's going to be a much, much slower process, which allows uh, the tree time, essentially for all the minerals in the volcanic ash, to be dissolved in water and moved into the structure of the tree itself. And it goes all the way down to the cellular level, so it fills up the spaces in those cells. And then through time, all the living material will leach out and decay away, and you're left over with the minerals crystallized in the shape of the cells. And that's what these are here? That's what these are right here. So essentially it creates an almost exact replica of what these trees would have looked like when they were living 3.4 million years ago. Wow. And these are some pieces uh, from another petrified forest in Arizona, which is the National Park. They were formed right beside a place called the Painted Desert, hence all the, the, the coloration you see there. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, what was your name? My name is Danny. Great. <laughs>